had nothing to do with what was on the board. It had everything to do with me. And I said, listen, you say no to me, that's a very, that's a very expensive decision on you. And I'm going to tell every single one of you guests, you say no to us, that decision will be the most expensive decision you make six months from now, I promise you. You blink your eye and watch Kleani go from just a small multi-million dollar company right now to hundreds of millions of dollars and a company that's shelling out more than 70% of their revenues right back to the distributors, right? Do you think some people are going to get rich? You better believe it. You better believe it. And what do you have to do as a brand new person, as someone brand new uh, and looking at our opportunity for the very first time? You just have to do 10%. You see, we've got a lot of uh, great leaders in the room, directors, senior directors, uh, executive directors, uh, Christina Palani here. Christina, stand up. You're another executive director. Uh, you saw Brandon, you saw Jennifer. I mean, all we do, really, is take on 90% of your load right off the bat. And that simply means is we're going to go live and we're going to help you build. I mean, I'm in meetings uh, just about all day long. And you know what? I have nothing else to do. I might as well just come and have lunch with you and talk about Kayani, right? That's a whole lot of fun. We do home meetings. We do these weekly meetings. And here's what you need to do, okay? Just first off, you just need to make a choice. You need to make a decision whether you want this or not. Now, here's what I'm going to tell you. If you, can, if you can make a choice to say, you know what? I do want this. I do want what they want, what they have, right? Um, and you could essentially leverage us to do 90% of your work and you do 10 by just simply letting us know that you want help. And you simply redirect the contact list our way. Tell me why you wouldn't cash the residual effects of what's going to happen when we grab your people and start building them checks, which builds you checks. Tell me why you wouldn't cash that check. You would, right? Yeah. All day long, all month long. And so this support system, you guys, is incredible. We have these meetings every single Wednesday night. Uh, we have a training that's coming up uh, in a couple of weeks. It's a Super Saturday, uh, the 21st, and it's going to be at the Larry Miller Conference Center in Sandy. Uh, we're going to start at 10 a.m. in the morning, okay? And 10 a.m., we, uh, what we do is we do a business opportunity meeting just like this uh, for about 40 minutes, 45 minutes, and then after that, we take an, uh, a lunch break, and then we come back for three hours of training. How many of you would love to get up a learning curve of how to build this business within three hours? Okay, then that's where you want to be. Now, here's the goal and here's the key for you. After you make the decision tonight to get in or, 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 or you know, you're going to kick the can around and kick it around, you know, all you want. Okay, just so, so you know, we're still going to be here. But what could that mean to you to kick the can around? Here's what it could mean to you, okay? It could mean a lost opportunity cost, really. Because you're going to show up to one of these meetings, if not our Saturday training, and you're going to see somebody that you knew, that you were going to think about, I'm going to go talk to that guy. I want that guy's matching check, and you see that guy sitting with another guy, mm -hmm. right? And that's when the stomach goes, oh man, I can't believe I waited, I can't believe I had to go tinker around with this thing, right? Proof is in the pudding, right here, okay? The support is critical to your success, and I'm telling you, you can ask any one of our leaders, we don't want anyone to fail, we don't. I mean, because, look, we don't make dimes till you make dollars, <laughs> right? So we got to make our dimes, okay? So once you make that decision, here's a part of the decision that you have to make too, okay? Here's part of the factoring into making your decision tonight. Why would you do this opportunity? Why? Why in the world would you jump into network marketing? How many of you have jumped into network marketing before? Tried something else before, okay? So here's what I expect that you're bringing to the table right off the bat. You're probably bringing some baggage, uh, some uh, you know, um, some, some frustration, some 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 pain, maybe, right, from another opportunity. Yes? No? Yes? Most of you would be yes, right? Okay. And here's the problem, right? Is, is, is a lot of us are going to say, well, you know what? I've seen this before. You know, Steve, I know a guy that says the same thing like you. He's not that handsome as you, but you know, he says the same thing. Okay. Uh, and it all sounds the same, right? And that's probably what you're thinking. And what's what's happening? even at the moment, is you're using your past to judge your present and your future. Are you guys with me, right? Yeah. And we've often heard, right? Your past typically, you know, predicts the future outcome. And, I, and here's what I have to say about that. Well, if you keep thinking about your past, you're going to continue to get what you got in the past. 
But if you think about what's here and now and what's available and you check everything at the door and you put everything on the, you know, on the shelf and you come here and you're coachable and you allow us to help you, I'm telling you right now, great things are going to happen for you and your family, okay? Um, so here's, here's the deal. Make that decision. Why would you do this, right? And for me, let me be very frank with you, okay? Yeah, money always looms in the mind of all of us, okay? I was not a health enthusiast when I saw the opportunity. But I had a BMW, a $95,000 vehicle parked in my garage that I didn't know how to pay for. I covered up the, the windows of the garage with newspaper so that the repo people wouldn't look in and see it and wait for me to repo my car. Okay, yeah, it was that bad, right? Um, I was thinking about having a garage sale just before I got in here so I could come up with a four ninety nine. Just didn't want to get rid of anything because um, I didn't have anything to get rid of, okay? Uh, but I've got to tell you something, okay? My why was the fact that I didn't know how I was ever going to become happy so that my kids could feel that, you know, that's happy because I was such in a bad place. And as much as I try to smile, you know, my kids could sense that dad was not right. Something's wrong with dad, right? And they're very young. And I didn't like, I didn't want that feeling. I didn't want them to feel that around me. So when I got into Kayani, that was my why. Let me tell you my why I'm, I'm doing this still. Because why not? <laughs> right? Why not get rich? Why not empower as many of you uh, to have what it is that you want? But let me tell you, when I got in, okay, in that very first month, one of the very first things I did of deciding why I was going to do this was I went to a list. I went and started making a list. And it wasn't a phone list, right, like some of you are probably going to do, okay? And, and, and if you want to fail, just keep your phone list. But I actually put pen to pad, and I wrote down and I brainstormed every single name I could think of, okay? And I made my, my plan. I was like, I was going to talk to every single one of those people on the list. There's still a lot of people on that list that I still haven't reached. That means things were good. Things have happened, right? And, and, and Jennifer can say the same thing. Jennifer, as a matter of fact, uh, just moved here to Utah so that she could finally go after her list. Because everybody that she talked to, that energy, that excitement, that enthusiasm was so contagious that people uh, didn't know what they were getting into, but they were also afraid to not follow Jennifer. And I'll tell you something, once you decide, and once you go home and make that list, okay, and you allow us to just enroll your people through these uh, opportunity meetings, you know, uh, through lunch meetings, through uh, home meetings, through our training sessions, okay, that we're going to have, okay, then here's what starts to happen. Your level of uh, excitement, enthusiasm starts to even escalate a lot more. When you start seeing the weekly paychecks, how many of you would love to see a paycheck next week from our company? Yeah. Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> that is awesome, right? What if you got a paycheck, regardless of the amount with your name on it, would it build your belief system a little bit more than where it is today, yes or no? Yes. It would, huh? Holy smokes, man. I mean, the $20 check would even be huge, right? Because you know that that could go up from there, okay? So in getting started, okay, just get with the person uh, that brought you here tonight. You know, I'd love to meet as many of you. Uh, if you have any questions, and Jennifer's going to be here as well. Chris is here. Uh, Brennan's in the back. You know, let us help you resolve any concerns or uh, anything that, you know, you need to get straight, you need to get clear. Uh, and, and, and let's get you in. Let's get you started. Uh, here's the thing that I know. When a, when a new buzz is on the streets, it doesn't take long for people to figure out that there's something happening. Would you agree with me? Yeah. How many of you are on Facebook? <laughs> Okay, I'm not, but you guys know what I'm talking about, right? You guys know what I'm talking about. I mean, you know, you have one friend, and next thing you know, you got a hundred friends, right? And, and and I'll tell you something, okay? The word is going to get out. The buzz is going to hit your street with or without you. Kayani is going to go to a billion dollars with or without you. You could be a part of that. You could be a part of this exponential growth curve that we're going to experience right now. You guys, I appreciate your time. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much to uh, Mrs. Jennifer Hawkins. And uh, you guys have a great night. Thank you. Let's get started. Yeah.